What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we are not in Pennsylvania anymore. We're actually all the way in Tennessee at Windrock Park with ZKD Custom. Zach's with us, he's showing us around. We got my Jeep and just look at the view from up here. So we're on the trail right now. We came up this way, we got the Jeeps right here. And you can see so far from up here. You can see basically three hours away where we came from. This side also looks sweet. There's some big windmills up there we just went to. But I think we're gonna go hit some trails now that we did some easy stuff getting up here. Just wanted to see this view and it's time to hit the trails. I did also fix my lockers last night, extremely stupid of me. Um, I took the ground off the battery, never put it back on, so we didn't have the ground, so none of it worked. We got lockers again, everything's working good. I did bring my spare tire this time since we are very, very far away from home and I have to drive this Jeep home, but let's go hit some trails. All right, so we're at the first little hill climb. Zach's gonna go first, and then we'll run up at second. Camera never does justice for how steep these are. This one's not terrible, but it is steeper than it looks on camera for sure. did it with really no issue. I think I'm gonna take the rockier line here and try to get up over this. A little concerned I might bottom out on it just being the four door and he was super, super close in a two door. But we'll figure it out. All right, here's the next hill climb. Not many rocks, but this thing is steep. It's got this weird little bend up there and a rock on the inside. So we'll see how Zach does it and we'll follow him up second. See how Zach does it. He might just go with speed after seeing how Zach drives sometimes. I tell you guys he was gonna go with speed i called that but i'll go ahead hand him the camera and we'll follow him up second Made it to the top of those like three hill climbs. So now Zach's gonna try this side, just a little steep, see how he does. Uh, he almost got high centered there, but he made it up. So let's go ahead, hop back in the Jeep and follow him up the hill.
not sure how well it'll show on camera, but this is already a steep hill right here. And then you got these obstacles up here that make it just a little bit harder. Up here, it's, you can't really see what's going on once you get up onto it. So I think that's where we're having a little bit of issue. Plus, if you get twisted up here wrong, there's a rut right there. Your back tire can go in, front tire lifts up, then you got an issue. Because that is a long roll down that hill if you don't make it to the top. So let's see if he can readjust and give it a better shot. right up at that time so that was just a better line to take right there Come back up this way. okay Now just bet yeah, just back up and, and cut it back this way. It's my time.
right, so we're at another kind of washed out rock face. And Zach is going to try the harder line on the right side here. See if he can get up this. Sidewall's on too. I mean, you could try. I wouldn't go crazy, but you can give it a shot. You're just spinning the other tires. Okay. Uh, a lot easier than what you were just at. You gotta hold that line though and not slide this way. You what? Hold that line and not slide this way. Back tire, this one's going down. This one's already up. No, it's not going up any higher. Well, I mean, eventually, yeah, but not right now. So you should get up at this, right? Your front's like two inches from going flat, and then your back's gonna go flat. pretty big rock face and he was just getting caught up right on here tires going underneath so there's really no way to grab and go up so he had to re line up come up over here get up there however he doesn't have lockers so I might go ahead and try that line see if we can make it up there if not we'll just do the route that he took and that should definitely get us up but I want to try that side first since we do our front and rear lockers and they're working again might as well give it a shot
All right, guys, we made it home. Very minor issues the whole drive home. So we made it pretty good throughout the whole trip and wheeling. Figured I'd save the outro for getting home just in case we did break down or had some major issue on the side of the road. It'd be part of the video. But we did have a couple small issues that I'll show you guys right now. So as you can see, the Jeep is absolutely filthy. I still have to clean it and everything like that. But the front driver's side uh, is making this weird like squeaking grinding sound. I'm thinking it's the bearing up there. So I'm going to jack it up and figure out what's wrong with it later today or tomorrow probably. And for some reason, the heat actually turned off on the way home from North Carolina. It was like 30 degrees, so it was freezing. I don't know what happened though because we turned the car off, turned it back on, and it worked again. So I'm not really sure what's up with that, but besides that, the Jeep did really, really good. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I'll definitely be going back to Windrock. That was a ton of fun, and it was really cool trails. Big difference between Windrock and Pennsylvania. So we'll definitely be making a couple trips back down there. But as always, guys, thank you so much for watching the video, and I'll see you in the next one.